It's Simon Corrigan from Beacon School Support here, and I just wanted to give our Behaviour 360 subscribers just a quick tour of our successful supervisors training program and just explain how to get started because it's a really crucial part of the day for kids in terms of behavior, lots of behavior issues start at lunchtime. So having really well-trained lunchtime supervisors is a must if we want to see improved behavior in school. So you can see I've logged into the dashboard already and I'm looking at my Behaviour360 premium resources. The Successful Supervisors program is held near the bottom. Now, this is how you access the program. Your supervisors will access the program in a completely different way using an app, so they won't have to come to the website and log in. If you've got access to an Apple iPad or an Android tablet, we have a separate app that they can launch just by tapping on the icon and getting straight into the training. Now, this is more of the portal where you'll come, where you want to do something like print out a certificate or look at the CPD guide. So you scroll down to the Behaviour360 Whole School Resources section and click on the Successful Supervisors tab. Now you'll see that across the top here we've got four tabs. We've got Level 1 and Level 2 and these contain all of the training videos for your supervisors. So if you want to come in and look at what they're learning you can jump in here. We've also got um, posters that go with different modules. So here we've got a Resolving Arguments poster and a How to Give Praise poster. So if I just jump into here for a minute to show you, it comes with posters that you can print out with summaries of the strategies that we've looked at or they sort of go over key ideas. And the idea is you can print these out and display them in areas where your lunchtime supervisors congregate to give them reminders of the content of the sessions. And as you can see, there's a lot of content here. There's about 44 videos in total. And at the end of each level, there's a certification test that is optional. Um, but if your lunchtime supervisors want a certificate to go through a test and get a certificate to prove what they've learned as part of their CPD, that function's available. However, when you start setting this program up for the first time, the place to head to is the resources section because this has got all of the resources as a manager that you'll need to get the program up and running. The key part to look at actually is, and we put these at the bottom for a reason because you're, you're only likely to look at these the first time you sort of set up the program in the first couple of weeks and after that you're unlikely to come back to them. But at the very, very bottom of the resources, you will find a set of training videos. There's one, two, three, four, five training videos and they will lead you step-by-step step through the process of setting up your successful supervisor's lunchtime training program. You'll also see here there are logos you can use on your website. There are certificates. We give you timetables. We give you trackers. We give you links to the apps if you want to use that instead of using laptops. We even give you lanyards to print out with... Um, with, uh, with, a, with a, a key approach to resolving arguments that we use in the, in the program. We've also got pre-flight pre pre even checklists to make sure you've got everything you need in place to get the program up and running successfully. So as a manager, you'll enter the system, come in through the uh, Behaviour360 portal, scroll down, come into, the, come into Successful Supervisors, and then come into the resources section because that's where everything you need to get the program up and running is stored. If I go back again, you'll also see here there's a bonuses section. So in the bonuses section, we've got a complete CPD framework, including targets for your lunchtime super supervisors to work towards, paperwork for things like setting targets and reviewing targets. If I um, That's delivered as a Word document. So you don't even have to think up your own targets if you're working with your lunchtime supervisors trying to develop their practice. All of the targets that we've written in our CPD framework to go on their performance management um, documents are linked to specific videos and we tell you which videos are which. And also in the CPD framework, we give you an overview of exactly what is included in each of the sections. So you can see here we've got development targets and then we've got a course map where you can go through and see exactly what content is used where and in what video and also the exact performance management targets that go with the content in that video. And then finally at the bottom, we've got an outstanding lunchtime checklist because if you want to see an improvement in lunchtime behavior, it's not enough just to train your supervisors. 
We also need systems around them that will encourage good behavior in our students. And the outstanding lunchtime checklist is based on behavior audits we've done in dozens and dozens and dozens of schools. We've collected together the best practice, the sort of things that you need in place to support your supervisors to make sure your systems and your training are working together. One last point I'd like to make with this is you will see there are a lot of videos here. The best way we found of training your supervisors is not to sit down for hours on end, you know, have a massive training day where you work through all of these units one after the other, because there's so much content here. Your supervisors are human and they're going to forget it. This approach we found best works with drip, drip, drip. So your supervisors watch a unit, uh, they complete a quick quiz, and then they spend two or three weeks practicing the one technique described in that unit, that one strategy. They, they rehearse it so they can use it, not perfectly, but confidently, and then they move on to unit two. So they're covering one video, one unit, every sort of two or three weeks. And over time, that drip, drip, drip effect of reminders and encouragement that's supplied in the videos will help lead your supervisors to behave your success. So I hope you found that useful. That's a quick explanation of the Successful Supervisors resources. Don't forget to get started. Go into the resources tab, scroll down to the bottom and check out the training videos. They will tell, they're, they're training for you. They will tell you as a leader, as a manager, how to get the program up and running quickly in your school. I hope you found that useful. Thank you very much.